Hello boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to another video today. And today I am in South Bank in Brisbane, Queensland, Australia. Right next to the Nepalese, Nepalese Pagoda piece. Right next to me as you can see. And it officially opened in 1988. It looks pretty interesting. And in this building, it's a pretty interesting shape as you can see and also right here there are also lions right here as well as you can see right there and there's a forest in there and some very historic stuff so i'm gonna have a look now So here I am just inside the building as you can see as you just saw that's a very interesting piece and things that people want to see in different cultures and traditions and up here there's a, another piece uh, right there. I don't think anyone can go inside unfortunately but if I could go up there I would but unfortunately not now outside there is some water right here as you can see then over here we'll go to the uh, gardens and to, to the forces right here as you can see there's many trees around as you can see around here and some waterfalls right here so it almost looks like a uh, city hike to me as you know there'd be many of these in the countries a very lovely adventure in the brisbane city and brisbane city has changed a lot over the last 30 years so as you can see there's rocks and waterfalls right here and then over here we're gonna have a bit of a more look um, as you can see there are the um, parks around here and then there's a lot more to it so and then here we are with a great city view as you can see there is um, the uh, parliament house I don't know if you can see it and then there is Queen's Wolf that I that is about to open in a few months time and I'm looking very much forward to uh, doing a video there uh, later on sometime this year and also very soon very sadly and I'm also very sad about it that Maya will be closing at the Maya Center in late next month so I'm gonna do video on that too I like the Brisbane City and I also am very proud to be the executive uterus slash president because it makes us proud of who we are and it is about teaching the next generation to be the best that it can be and you're going to hear me say that a lot for the next many more years and decades to come so a very interesting piece that I just showed you so I'm going to uh, end the video here Thank you very much for watching as always. Please like and subscribe. And I will see you next video with more videos to come. 
in the coming future. Bye everyone, thank you kindly.